I think that one of the best ways to get better at something is to surround yourself with people that are better at that skill than you and to just learn from them. So I managed to convince Simon from the 4C Forest channel, one of my favorite YouTubers and mountaineer, to let me tag along on a summit hike. Mount Harrison is the southernmost 11,000er in the Canadian Rockies. I want to learn a lot about rope planning and just what my body is capable of, so I think this is going to be a good one. Okay, so this is not your average peaceful hike. We are deep in the mountains, about two hours down a forest service road. And the first hour of the hike is bushwhacking through alder trees still covered in rain from the night before. We are in for some type two fun. That was quite the brutal bushwhacking, but I find bushwhacking easier than going up the mountain. I'm about to be, woo! <laughs> I'm about to be pushed outside of my comfort zone going up this thing. Walking along that skinny edge. I'm so out of breath. This is way harder than Forrest who makes it seem. Just resting on the edge. <laughs> Casually on the side of a cliff right now. Rock of the mountain dog. It has to be one of the most humbling things to just look up at this mountain and all these rocks could just come crumbling down on you. You are nothing to the mountains. I did it and what I did is not the summit I stopped right before I just pushed myself farther than I've climbed before and I'm proud of what I did thanks to Simon for pushing me this far because I wouldn't have gotten this far without his help and I'm sorry I made you go to the summit alone Simon just went up the last front of it. And there's the summit! Oh, dang it! <laughs> I guess I'll be back, Mount Harrison. I mean, I am a little bummed, but how can I be that bummed when I've climbed this far? It took us a total, well, it took me a total. We started at 6 a.m. and it's now 12 p.m. I took my time, took us six hours of climbing and just meat grinding through this debris and no footing and just a oh, shamble of a rock wall. So <laughs> I'm proud of what, what I did. So how can I be that bummed? It's still an awesome adventure. Oh my God, it's a painting. Someone's response to, it looks like a painting, was that's because people paint landscapes. And that's what I think of any time I say that. Now I have to get down this thing. And the clouds are rolling in. It's supposed to rain tonight.
Oh my gosh, I'm driving out now and I just saw my first bear. I've only ever seen bears from the car, which I'm kind of grateful for, but wow, he was a big brown bear. Holy crap. <laughs> I'm headed home and the rainy weather has turned to sunshine and Sam and I have parted ways. I'm still going down this forest service road along Bull River and it's so blue. I think I want to do a cold plunge. Considering I just saw a bear a couple kilometers back, I'm a little scared but let's do it. We're going to do it scared. That's the theme of this trip. Too many rocks. 